Hi, I am Dash Arani. In this video, I will demonstrate one of the methods that we use in HPV PCR to locate HPV related growth. We introduced this technology for the very first time in our center as a pioneer to identify, locate, and map genital warts even with less visibility. This is a crucial step because if a clinician misses a small lesion, then treatment is incomplete. HPV is a location specific infection meaning you have it in one area, but you don't have it in few millimeter further in neighboring locations. So it is imperative to find all HPV related infected area, even with less visibility. My original approach was based on HPV related tumors, such as genital warts that are highly vascular. HPV related tumors produce TGF alpha, which causes angiogenesis and as a result, uh, related growth has so many blood vessels. This is done mainly so HPV tumors can have oxygen and nutrition supply to grow faster than other normal epithelial cells. This is how it works. Projected near 1000 nanometer light is absorbed by blood and reflected by surrounding tissue. The information is captured, processed by computer and projected back on the infected area digitally in real time directly onto the surface of the skin. As you see green color on the skin, it provides a real time accurate image of the patient's blood pattern. These are the numerous area of the HPV related tumors that you can see that attacked uh, by this projectile uh, technology. And uh, these are active blood vessels, live uh, congestions of blood flow. So live skin, we see the blood vessels going to the HPV. We can see blood vessels pattern under the skin surface as well as highly vascular HPV related tumors. Basically tissue with higher blood volume and congestion such as blood vessels mapped and projected back on genital warts and it looks darker and visible genital than surrounding tissue. Genital warts or benign HPV tumors will be tagged and located which will be removed by BCR in the next step.